What is up, everyone? We are back with another review. Um, I do want everyone to uh, remember that I am doing the giveaway for all my subscribers. If I get to 10,000 subscribers by April 20th, I will be giving away a Supreme Box Logo sweatshirt that's black. Uh, so make sure you subscribe and maybe you'll win that. Um, as you can see, I'm wearing the Mountain Jacket, the North Face Supreme Mountain Jacket um, with the Mountain Print. Definitely one of the most ironic jackets that the North Face has ever put out there. Alright, we're going to be going back to some a little bit normal. We'll be going to the North Face Gore-Tex uh, Steep Series Jacket. Um, this one came out in 2013 and retailed right around $600. Um, but let's go to the closet, get it pulled out, and see what it looks like. Alright, let's go to the closet, get it pulled out. Um, it is one of the nicer ski jackets I have. It's a classic tricolor jacket. We'll get it pulled out so you can see it. Oh yeah, there it is. And give me just one moment and I will get everything set up. Alright guys, so here we have the full jacket. Like I said, this is the Steep Series that came out in 2013. And it did come out in two different uh, models. This is the less warm model, but the other one is a two-tone model. It kind of is um, a diagonal pattern, like a color right here, another color, and then that same color right down there. Um, hopefully I'll get one to review sometime, but it is a very cool jacket. Um, this is nice and simple with three tones that I truly like. These are the same colors of my um, hockey team grown up, so I knew I had to have this jacket. And some of the features on the inside are very cool, um, but on the outside it's just um, a very simple North Face Deep Series jacket that is with Gore-Tex as well. Um, so as you can see right here, we do have a pocket. Um, this is built for both cell phones and radios. And then as you can see, we have another pocket right down here, um, which is going to be for like your bash badge and then also for like a goggle cleaner. It comes with one already built in there. And then as you can see right down here, hopefully, I'll get adjusted. Yeah, it's hard to see nowadays, but it just says Gore-Tex right down there. And on this one it says Rico, um, which is the inside detecting system, um, which kind of sends out a magnetic sim a magnetic uh, wave uh, to a beacon device if you're ever in an avalanche. So I'll show you that inside. But on the outside, it's just a nice, simple jacket um, that is built for snowboarding or skiing with the Steep Series logo right there. Um, give me one moment. I'll get it opened up and show you the inside. All right, so we have the jacket open up, and the first thing you kind of see right off the back is the um, North Face Steep Series um, and the tag, and then this little thing right here. Um, this is a checklist, so if you ever go out um, kind of skiing in high intense areas, um, this is kind of a checklist that you'll want to have. So this is kind of pretty cool. It has a map, water bottle, uh, make sure you have food, uh, first aid kit, like a shovel, rope, matches, like a switchblade, a headlight, uh, somebody else to go with, and maybe like a safety guidebook. So it's reminding you to have all that before you go out, um, just because you never know what kind of circumstances you will run into. Um, this is kind of a big theme on the jacket, just because right here, um, as you can see, it's the goggle um, pocket, a snow skirt, and then right down here, it is the Rico um, Tecting, it is the garment equipped with a advanced rescue reflector. Um, so what this is saying basically is if you're ever in an avalanche, um, there's some magnetic strips in here that will give off a, um, like, a sim like a symbol or something to a, a rescue device letting you know that you're in the snow. And every first responder and ski resort has this uh, Rico detecting system. So there are some in the jack and I thought it was one of the coolest features I've never seen on any other North Face. Um, it is a very different jacket. Uh, let me get it uh, turned over so you can see the back as well. Alright, and here is the back jacket. Um, so nothing crazy about the back, uh, similar to the front, just the three colors. Um, but I just really enjoy the colorway just because it is my high school, or my a hockey team growing up. And then it's also just nice, simple three colors right off the back, which is like the classic uh, tricolor summit. Um, so I really do enjoy this jacket. Um, give me one moment, I will get it put on so you guys can see it on body. Alright guys, you can see I have it on body right now. Um, this is a big mountain like big mountain line for premium athletes just because it is supposed to be for like extreme sports because it is the North Face and this is one of their 
uh, signature series that usually does cost a good amount. Uh, this jacket is right around $600 retail when it did come out. Um, it's a little bit long, but it is an extra large, and I usually wear large. So I honestly would say it fits true to size just because go, uh, snowboarding and skiing jackets go a little bit longer uh, just because of the snow skirt on the inside. But as you can see, the pockets are lower because people don't usually wear backpacks while they're doing kind of like this kind of skiing or snowboarding. Um, we've got the pocket right here for your bash badge and uh, your goggle cleaner. You can see the back. It's just a nice clean design that you used to see a lot with skiing and snowboarding jackets. Get it opened up. It's a nice warm jacket. You won't have to wear much under it unless it's in the negatives and you want to put a layer under it. It's a nice warm jacket, great lining, great technology. Um, I really think you would like it if you did get it. Other than that, I think the review's over. Um, so other than that, make sure you like and subscribe um, for a chance to win that Supreme Box logo. Add me on Twitter and Instagram. It's the rare face. It's kind of like the North face, but it's the rare face. Other than that, we'll see you next review.